Farm. For surprisingly great rates, like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. Uh, the Rockets had prepared themselves for liftoff, largely using veteran players and acquiring players outside the trade. And it's really paid off. They had eight straight playoff appearances, made it to the finals a couple of times during that time span. 639 winning percentage was third best in the NBA. Russell Westbrook, James Harden, though, within about a month or so, 2021, traded and then mission completely scrubbed. Worst in the NBA, and now they haven't drafted a player that became an all-star for them since Yao Ming. So now they're hoping to do it. Who should they take it to? Well, if you want to score Jalen Green, I think that's who you expect to go, Mike. But but I would lean more toward Evan Mobley myself from USC. Seven feet tall, a graceful athlete with a 7'4 wingspan that really is the best big man defender in this draft because he can switch off on a point guard and just pick and roll defense and, and guard for two, three dribbles, shot blocker, rebounder. I think it's going to be a great player. Well, if the Rockets knew better, they'll do better. And they need Jalen Green like old people need soft shoes, right? This guy is electrified. <laughs> he's a superstar in the making. I think he's a mixture of Tracy McGrady and Jalen Brown. When you look at him, he's, he got stardom all over him. Just look at his hand in his suit tonight. I'm with Big Perk. I think Jalen Green has the most star potential in this draft. And by the way, it's not easy to go to the G League and average 19 points a game at 18 years old. That doesn't half often. So I love Jalen Green's upside. I just learned something. I now know why Billis wears soft sneakers all the time. <laughs> <laughs> You're older than I am. That's not true, but it's close. <laughs>